Hi, this is Dan Johnson, president of the Solutions Institute. At the first activist online training conference, we spoke about how to improve our argument instead of raising our voice. Don't let any of the, of the trappings of an interview uh, intimidate you in any way. And that goes for whether you are the interviewee or the interviewer. There is something about wearing those headphones for the host that's like, I have power. But people will read that, not with their eyes, but with their ears. To be taken seriously in the activist community, you need to know what you're talking about. How this applies to my point is the fact that if you know what you're talking about, whether you're 14, 16, 21, 40, 100, people will listen to you. When we got together for ActCon 2, we talked about how much messaging mattered from start to finish. You have one chance to get a hold, get people's attention, hold it and ask them to do something. Don't pass it up. Speak truthfully, honestly, persistently, and with, with, with all your heart. And I think you have the strongest uh, chance of success. When we revisit the project, we, we go back to the basics and we have to establish what is the message, what is that value, and, and who's the audience? How are we going to speak to them? And if we can nail down those two things, it's no longer a matter of being this, this fuzzy concept of creative and coming up with something fun and new and creative. It's really connecting a message with an audience. Empowering activism is the focus of ActCon 3. Please join Antiwar.com's Angela Keaton, Code Pink's Allie McCracken, Defense Attorney Sarah Swain, Kofi Hunt, and more for ActCon 3 Empowering Activism noon to 7 Eastern Time, Saturday, September 19th, live online at solutions-institute.org slash actcon3.